just my natural wake up time today. Okay, I woke up to a text from Rob. If you don't know him, Rob built. Airbnb YouTuber building a house in Joshua Tree with him. Woke up to a text from him about his friend's house in Joshua Tree that's doing incredibly well. And it definitely inspired me to go, okay, let's get these permits going. So that's that's on the to-do list for today. I hate having random stuff at my desk like this. No, this goes in here. This will keep out though. Okay, let's see how the editor that I hired is doing on the project. Let's make breakfast and I'll talk to you guys about how it's going trying to create this new system where I don't have to edit as much. So far, um, we're not there yet. I know it just takes time for people to figure out your style. So I sent the, what I filmed yesterday to an editor and he worked on it. I took a look this morning and it just wasn't there yet. Like I just pretty much re-edited the whole beginning and I would re-edit the whole thing. It's so hard, I just... Find with creative work, I'm so, I wouldn't even call myself a perfectionist, but just like, I just know what's gonna do well. I don't really expect someone to get it on the first try, but that would be cool. Oh, it's really thin. Might be a weird pancake today. <laughs> okay, these pancakes, these are very like crepe-like. I'm doing like a double batch. So I can just quickly eat them tomorrow, heat them up and like the microwave, but let's see how these ones turned out. I honestly like it as all consistencies, but the thin is good. To do my daily exercises that the physical therapist gave me to do, I also have to do a single leg wall sit, only for 20 seconds. This is way harder than it looks. I'm supposed to like press against the wall. All right, having lunch, I'm doing some thumbnail brainstorming. Thumbnails are the most important part of if a video is going to get views or not. I always leave it till the end and I'm just taking the whole day to really think of actually amazing thumbnails, plan them out, and start to make them because they are that important. I'm Shelby Church. If you've never heard of me, I have a bunch of videos. I'm attempting to be a thumbnail queen. This is what we've got so far. It's okay. It's I think it's pretty good. I don't know, something about it is not quite there yet. That's a crazy thing with thumbnails. I could spend all day making one and still be like, mm, it's okay. Making a really good thumbnail that's actually gonna perform well is actually so difficult. And they're, they're just, they're daunting. I watched this YouTube video about how thumbnails, like most of it is in the concept of it and the psychology of making you wanna click. Not as much actually in the design or like any of that. And I think that's pretty true. And I'm just struggling with it with this video. All right, I've continued switching it up. Now we are gonna draw like a yellow arrow. I love that color. That actually looks pretty good. I think the arrow kind of ties together this thumbnail. So I have access to a feature on YouTube where I can try a few different thumbnails. So you can see I tried like, I tried two different thumbnails on that one. And then after like a couple days, it'll just automatically select the one that's doing better. I don't think that YouTube has released that tool to everyone yet, but this will be one of them. You can do, I think, up to three. So we'll do this one. I just finished editing the fun vlog, the more like high quality one, and I'm gonna set it uploading. Actually gonna set it uploading to Rembrandt. They're the company that does the AI product placements. Like they'll put it right there. It's a way for me to earn more from vlogs. I can then allocate other video stuff, like hiring people to edit the future vlogs. Cause I wanna hire that out too. I'm out here studying, trying to keep my face in the shade so I can actually see my laptop. So right now I'm on the um, disclosures portion of this course. Good morning, it's Thursday. I thought it was Wednesday, it's Thursday. I spent the whole morning re-editing that video that I had an editor edit. I have to get it to the brand today. So I had to get it done right today. I have to run to the grocery store really quick because I need to get a shot of the price of cereal for a video, but I also need to pick up some stuff cause I'm hosting later. I'm gonna try and make a recipe I've never made before. 
So I'm having about five people over later. I got two pounds of salmon and like an extra little piece in case that's not enough, but I think two pounds should be enough. When it comes to hosting, personally, I don't like to do more than eight people total. I don't like to host like a big party. It's just a lot of mess to clean up, a lot going on. You don't even get to talk to each person that much. So I think a five to six person group, that's my personal preference. So that's what we're doing later today. And I think it'll be fun and just, it's not too overwhelming. It's not too much to clean up. It's just easy and, and fun. Okay, now we're heading back to solid core to actually take the class. It's gonna be hard. I'm like, oh gosh, here we go. And it's a little bright, but whatever. Okay. <laughs> it's your staff. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, if you need it. Oh, cool. Whoa. Now slide hinge forward so you don't feel it in your back end. Now drive all the way up and then slow. So Hit gray cables on the outside of your platform. Nice to know that I said yes, Shelby. Okay, people are gonna get here soon, so I'm starting to make the food, the orzo, the pasta. <sighs> the solid core class honestly was tiring. I'm like, whoa, my body is shaky. Like, do I have a six pack now? Because I feel like it. I'm just gonna cut them in pieces like that, I think. Yeah. I'm gonna, let's see how this knife goes. I'm not sure. That's I'm... not a knife. A sushi knife in my apartment, though. That's, that's... well, the sushi knife is a knife. That's a knife. <laughs> very. <laughs> I might have to go for the sushi knife. Hi. I don't have like a spatula thing, so this is how we're doing it. Um, we for sure will need. <laughs> Happy Friday, everybody. I'm currently getting ready. We had people over last night, grilled, we made dinner, and it turned out actually so good. And now I'm inspired to be like, okay, I can make salmon myself whenever. Cause I don't know, I just felt like I didn't really know how to cook it well, but honestly, you throw anything on a grill and I swear it just tastes really good. Like Okay, I'm recording the rest of the grocery store grief video. I have to use a light. It just looks better with a little key light. And honestly, I'm not even gonna bother with this microphone because it wasn't plugged in quite right the first time, so. A big topic of discussion when it came to food inflation for a while was the price of all right, I got my three thumbnails done. Two of them are similar. I'm interested to see which does better, the blue background or like the real background. And then this one's just a different kind of collage style. So we will run the thumbnail test and see tomorrow how it does. It's almost 4 p.m. The video is uploading, so I'm almost done for the week working on stuff. I actually have no idea. I hope it does well, but uh, I've just been really like stressing over the thumbnail. It's a great time of day slash weekend when I can put my voice over the mic away. <laughs> and we've reached that time. Cause it's just very like cluttered looking. It's like three different chords in one. This means that I'm done editing at 4 p.m. Finished a little bit. I finished at a good time actually this week. I am heading out. I'm going to see the Challengers movie with the tennis group, the Racket Club LA group. There's a bunch of us that are gonna go see Challengers. So let's go. I'm excited to see it. I, it actually has really good reviews. So we'll let you guys know what I think. It's Saturday morning and I am up early for an 8 a.m. city tennis class. My dishwasher is kind of broken, so it's a little crazy over here, but let's go. We're out. So I was like, I want a smoothie. I'm going to a friend's birthday brunch. So I don't want to like eat too much, but a smoothie sounds like birthday. Got some emergency protein bars. You always gotta have them. Okay, I'm heading out. I didn't vlog getting ready because I feel like I just get too many comments about people that don't like when I'm doing my makeup and stuff. So I'm wearing this kind of a beachy vibe, but we're going to Bakari in West Hollywood. If you're ever in LA, it's a really good lunch, brunch, or dinner spot. They have a 
bottomless mimosa or like well drinks whatever for 90 minutes any time of day so if you're trying to like i don't know have a have a day drinking day like that but you miss brunch or like at nighttime, that's like a fun place for that actually. I feel like that's gonna be the vibe today for all of us, so I've been hydrating. I mean, I don't wanna go that crazy. I just never wanna be hungover anymore, but um, it is a better value if you're gonna have like two, two or more, probably. I don't know, I can't decide, I can't decide. We'll see. <laughs> Us here years ago. Woo! Okay, guys, hello. It's Sunday. Feeling pretty good today. And we are gonna have a really fun Sunday because I'm going to play tennis in Malibu. So, a coach from the Marina Racket Club is running live ball classes at a house he rented in Malibu. Um, so, he invited me to come out and kind of like host a class with some other tennis girlies. I'm back so amazing playing at that court just so beautiful if you guys want to play if you live in LA and you want to play in Malibu I will link below where you can either book live ball or a private lesson with Ben his live ball classes are so good because he feeds the ball in extremely quick so you get such a good workout the court was just stunning so can't recommend enough I definitely want to go back there I made a kind of Mediterranean <clears throat> Greek inspired omelet. Good morning. I've been editing and I'm taking a little break to go get my phone screen fixed because it is very cracked. Um, and I ordered a screen protector so I don't crack it anymore. I keep cracking it when I put it on this tripod. Um, but I have Apple Care, so it's actually not expensive to fix. Little mini grocery list. So we'll take a little editing break then get back to it. back I had to go pick something up for this reel that I'm making I'm just like tired from running around so I'm having one of these little productivity shots it's from magic mind and it's like matcha it's supposed to help your mental clarity boost energy and focus like I, I probably just need water honestly but I just recorded this Instagram story brand deal that I'm doing and I just had to go pick this up for it. I ordered it online with the Capital One shopping extension app, but I ordered it to pick it up and I'm glad I did because they were fully out of stock. So I was able to still get this one. This is actually a tennis set, but I feel like it's just a cute outfit too um, from Aloe. Like I'm just gonna wear this like randomly all the time, but I can wear it to tennis too. Like it's got shorts. It was 30% off because they're having a sale. So I guess I'll link down below some of my tennis faves, but now I'm going to edit together the um, thing that I made. One leg, we'll sit, we're on the last set. It's tough, it's harder than it looks, but it's getting easier as I... It only takes 20 minutes to go through the exercises. I only showed you guys one though. <sighs> Let's go make dinner. I got some salmon because that salmon thing I made when I had people over was actually so good and healthy. That I'm gonna make it again. I'm gonna do some quinoa with it this time instead of the orzo. Salmon turned out pretty good today. I did arugula instead of the orzo pasta. It's like a little less than an hour till the sun sets. I haven't really gotten outside today or moved much. So I'm just gonna go drive to a bougie neighborhood and go on a walk. I haven't done this in a long time, but I love doing this. Just listening to a podcast, looking at really cool houses. So that's gonna be our evening. <laughs> walk beautiful walk so glad i took it highly recommend if it's getting nice out where you live it's just so nice a podcast and a walk oh my god so relaxing i 
am obsessed with making these protein pancakes. They're just so good and healthy and like, oh, I don't know. I just could eat them every day. We are doing the exercises from the physical therapist. I have them all on this app. Basically. Guys, I am in a get shit done mood. My place is clean. I cleaned it a good amount last night. And now I just finally feel like I can focus and have my phone on do not disturb for most of the day and just like get stuff done. I don't know. It's too, if my place is messy, it just can't. It just can't. It just gets so annoyed at stuff and distracted and i'm finally set up for success so we're gonna really try and get a lot done finishing the solid core video first yeah we just need to get this thing done it's basically done but it needs to i just feel so good to have it just on youtube scheduled thumbnail ready to go nothing else to do to it and that's that's where we're going Okay, I'm hitting render on this video. I did end up making it more of just like a podcast style interview because we didn't have time. Well, and didn't really have time to get B-roll like at a studio. And I just feel like I kind of like listening to a long form interview better anyway myself. So I thought, let's just try that. Feels a little weird because honestly it's easier. So I feel like, am I taking the easy way out by not editing it into a longer or into a shorter 10 minute video? I don't know. I don't know. Cause people might enjoy it just the same, but I'm gonna make some food. I'm recording the video about problem with having an Airbnb, like five things that people tend to overlook. Um, Cause I thought of some that I was like, dang, people really should know this. Oh, I should take some thumbnail photos. I also find, okay, so for like a thumbnail photo, tank top. I don't know what it is, but like it's too frumpy looking if I'm wearing a bunch of clothes. It is better, I think, to wear like just a tank. While I have this set up and my hair looks okay, I'm actually gonna put on a few different outfits and take thumbnail photos. Just never know when you might need them. All right, I'm gonna leave this edit here for now because I need to actually dedicate some time to studying real estate stuff because I haven't done a lot of that um, in the last couple days. A little bit yesterday, but not, not like enough. So yeah. Let's go do it outside. Wow, that little bowl I made, that salmon bowl I just made was divine. It was so good. I'm gonna remake that so much, I feel like. I'm putting some of this hair mask in my hair so that while I go play tennis, it can marinate, marinate, marinate. Marinate it. And when I wash it, it will be so soft. At least I hope. Hey, it just finished class. I have a hankering for some watermelon. Like that just sounds so good. So yeah, let's do it. 